Hi guys, Michael here with our first unboxing. Um, this is the Darksiders Hellbook Edition for the PC. It's only available for the PC as far as I'm aware. Um, you can't get this edition for PS3 game and 360. I, you can get the game though. So, let's take this plastic covering off which just says Darksiders Hellbook Edition and has got all the writing on the back. Get into the actual box. It's really nice. Um, so actually, you can actually feel the logo on it. Um, it's in like a gold kind of colour with the writing around it. It's quite glossy, shiny. Uh, the whole book really. And then you've got on the back, you can see the Dark Siders logo. Um, it's quite faint, and then you've got a little molten bit coming through. Um, so inside the actual book, you're going to get the Dark Siders logo and name. And on this side, you get um, a thank, you, first edition thank you letter from the um, developers at Vigil. Then you're going to get the next four pages of the Horseman. So you've got War, the main character. Um, Death, no, wait. War, the main character, who's here, um, with some concept art. Death, who you get is Harvester. You don't see him until the end. Now, this horseman here is um, Strife, which isn't one of the original four horsemen. They took Fury and they, no, they took Famine and Pestilence and turned him into Strife. And he's got these two pistols that you can see artwork of later on. And Fury, the fourth horseman of the apocalypse, um, she's like anger and stuff. And then a map of the Dark Siders world with the crossroads, um, the Twilight Cathedral. It's the one from the game, basically. And then that's the last page. So down here you can uh, get access to your uh, your art guide, which we'll get to at the end, and our Darksiders game. Um, it requires internet access to install, uh, PC, Vigil, THQ. It's got a free soundtrack and digital comic. But, um, on the inside you've got your instruction guide with your code down here at the bottom but I've got my finger over that. It's a two disc installation. Um, this one's also got your soundtrack on it and comic. Um, we've got the back of the box with the summary and everything. And finally, this is a really good reason. I picked this up for 15 quid, and this is a really good reason to get it if you like game art and stuff. Um, the back of it has got the Dark Sider logo and a kind of like outline of war. And then on the front it's got War, um, War Fury, you can't make out, oh and the Death in the background there with his long hair, but you can only see War and Fury on there. Then inside you get um, War Fighting a Demon, and then the map again. And two nice pictures of um, the Chaos Eater. Then you go into the old ones, you've got War, all the concept art and things for War. Um, and then you've got Death and Fury. No, yeah, no, Death and Strife, sorry. And then Fury and the old Black Hammer guy, I can't remember his name. And you're into the Angels, so you've got um, Uriel, um, Abaddon. And then you've got these four cards in here, which, have, which are um, War Riding on Ruin, um, this big demon guy with Raw, War about to kill him. Uh, war on Ruin again. I might scan these in a minute, this is my background. And War confronting Samael. Um, you get, speaking of Samael, there is Samael in here with some really good concept art, which I'll probably scan and upload as slideshows or actually no, because I bought this book so I get to see it. But yeah, this is a really good reason to buy this book. Um, we've got drawings of all the characters in it, all the all all of the demons that you fight your way through, all of the little bugs. Such a good book. It was. Hidden. Then you can get near the end to find the weapons. Uh, but first off, the, like the scenery and everything in the game. So it's just like concept of each area, which I think all this stuff looks fantastic. So I will put the game in. Um, I will install it. And then hopefully there'll be a review of it later on. Um, this is Michael, thank you for watching our first unboxing.